and then we got six to hand, he went through the middle. Go for it. Now, pass it. If you care, share. Okay? Play with the right gnocchi though. You know the people, let's go. Let's go for it. Now, pass it around. I want you to play with it because I want you to understand that the right gnocchi though, it does not stick to your hand. You see that? It doesn't stick. So now, what can we do with this? Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? Wait, no. What we need to do with this, it's a little bit of flour. Look, really guys, look. It's a little bit of flour. Now hold it up with the leftover on your finger, you go like that. You see this? Now check this out. That's all you need to do. You make, you shape the dough in about like a tennis ball, a little smaller than a tennis ball, okay? And you roll this just like that, okay? One, you see that? Anyone else? No, he did. There is a danger in overworking it, sure. But if you spend an hour and you still, now that you've seen it, if after one hour you still don't have this, just question yourself. <laughs> because you said, look, okay, Fabio made this in 10 minutes. I'm about 30 minutes in, I'm not Fabio, but maybe I'm doing something wrong. Okay? Common sense. I know it's an option, but it's a good one to buy. Eh? Eh? Rolling it. Can you, how long then? Five seconds. Feel their big like this. Now, if you have a, if you have a kind of a cylinder that is this diameter, you maybe need to roll a little bit more. Make sense? So, think about, think about a good size cigar diameter. So, now we got this, right? Now we got this. We're gonna put a little bit more flour on it. Guys, honestly, look. I've been working hard since I was 11. 11 years old in the restaurant business. But there is, during this demo, at any given time that you thought that I was working my butt off? No. Great. Because I wasn't. Cook is a great, be, be a cook, be a chef, whatever you want to call it. I don't like labels. I hate labels anyway. Be a chef is a great profession and it's very hardcore working hour. But make good food is a simple task. It's very simple. As simple as bake potato and buy a KitchenAid or whatever appliances you have. Now, at this point, we cut the gnocchi. You see that? Okay, guys. So, let's be realistic now. Can you bake a potato? Seriously, can you? It's easy, right? Because you have one. You're halfway there. That's how I get out.